of my well, it's not a lot, but some of my sub subscribers um, have made mention on the fact that uh, vehicles will drive uh, somewhat closer to me. It turns out that uh, it's an illusion, an illusion from the quote-unquote fish eye view of uh, on the camera I use. In I do case, there's usually plenty of space between um, myself and and the vehicle, so. It's fine. All right. Oh, 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 oh. Uh. All right. I'm looping today eighty Ks. I hope I survive, especially that I haven't cycled in a while. Ah, so greatest road. Ah, attend the market somewhere near Chalimbana. Ah, and then Kasisi. From Kasisi, I, uh, I connect into Nguerere Road and then I head back home. Yeah, it's going to be quite the ride here. Really excited. I can only hope that uh, there aren't any major problems. Like something I experienced uh, a few days ago. Had a puncture and uh, had to drag this thing for what seven k's, almost eight kilometers. Probably one of the largest punctures I've had so far. Incidentally, uh, the rear tire probably has about what five maybe six patches now huh. really excited at the same time I'm dreading the pain I'm going to have to go through I normally do what 60 k's 60 to 70 60 k's actually uh, on weekends, I'll be an extra 20, 20 kilometers today. A uh, heads up if you're going to watch this thing at some stage, once it's up on YouTube or something, I have to apologize up front. I'm probably going to run out of battery power midway through. The plan though is uh, at some stage I'll have to redo this so that I capture the portion of the stretch that is not going to be recorded. At my usual rate I should run out of battery power when I'm making a turn from Greatest Road into Kasisi Katende Road I think <laughs> Alright Just living life Living life to the max. So something else that's exciting about my itinerary today is I've, 
I've never cycled through it before so here yeah, to hoping I survive Probably take me four hours or something <sighs> to get back home. Need a ah. I guess this is uh, the part where my mother would say we pray to God or the gods or something for good luck So I'm taking it easy right now because I I know that uh, at some stage the pain will start So to try and avoid making this video too monotonous, especially as I'm covering Greatest Road, I will likely cycle through back roads.
something off that's uh, freaking me out right now is I haven't been consistently cycling these last couple of days. Uh, so my hindsight probably would have been a good idea if I gave my body a chance to acclimatize itself, but. So I'm gonna take it easy up until I get to Silverest, I suppose. Then I can try and hit the pedal. Uh, I know a lot of my, well, it's not a lot, but some of my sub subscribers um, I've made mention of the fact that uh, vehicles will drive uh, somewhat closer to me. It turns out that uh, it's an illusion, an illusion from the quote-unquote fish eye view of, uh, of the camera I use. And I do case there's usually plenty of space between um, myself and, and the vehicle, so it's fine. All right. There's a Strava segment uh, that's been marked here. I think I'm on position number nine or something. Uh, For the first time today, I'll probably have maps activated throughout the itinerary. Last thing I'd want is to make a wrong turn and end up covering much, much more than 80 k's. All right. Uh, Uh, and not to worry, I uh, made sure I carried plenty of water and snacks also. Yes, I'll take a detour here. All right.
also forgot about my ass. That's the one thing that normally irritates me during these long stretches. This guy is turning right here and Kazam!